and elsewhere, the Lord Bishop of the Anglican Diocese of Just, the Most Reverend Benjamin Kwashi, has identified errors made by new believers in Christ or those who guide them in their journey to repentance and as Christians. While in a weekly meditation, Most Reverend Kwashi said that the process of giving one's life to Christ takes time and in three stages, which everyone must undergo strictly in order not to fall back into sin. The only way suffering will make sense is when you by choice say, Father, you sent Jesus to die on the cross for me. I believe. Please save me. Now, the process is not verbally only because what happens that suffering continues to multiply and you cannot help yourself is when it is only verbal. You know, we say to people, receive Christ and they get up. And say, I believe. And, and we leave it at that point. Satan is happy. Satan knows how to attack us. He attacks us when we are lonely. But when you make that commitment, you have to make a second commitment and choose that I am going to follow Jesus. Then the third aspect, which is the most important, is now you will now go to your own room where you are alone, where Satan usually tempts you and plans all those evil. And you will scream to God and say, Lord, I repent. Because the process is that it is no longer your effort. Now God takes over from that point. He now comes into you in the Holy Spirit. And in your quiet moments with God, he begins to walk with you. That process is not rushed. And it is built over time, one day after another. I'm speaking to you as a re retired sinner. I know it. And in my own case, I was in the barracks where the temptations are beyond repair. <laughs> 